All right, I have a 1968 M715 Kaiser four-wheel drive. This thing is cool as crap. Um, not that crap's cool because it's kind of steamy, but uh, anyway. It's a uh, pretty freaking sweet. Oh, I'll show you something in just a second. Uh, the floors are not in bad shape. They look bad rusted, but they're not. They're pretty solid. Um, thing shuts like an army tank. I'm sure it probably rides like an army tank. Um, the bed is in excellent condition. It's going to be a good starter. Um, okay, so they've got the bench seats in it. I've never seen one. Not that I'm a professional or a guru of them because I'm not, but I thought this was cool. Um, it's an old glass milk barn jug. When you get milk, uh, I live pretty close to dairy country, and uh, well, I live in dairy country. Anyway, all y'all's milk and stuff like that goes through a thing like that. <clears throat> There's the old original gas can. As you can see, it not ever gonna hold gas in, but it's cool. I'm gonna make something out of it. I'm gonna put a new bottom in it and weld it. And, uh, probably gonna make some kind of like a, I've seen these toolboxes that people are doing anyway um, the tires I only had two rims so I cut the centers out of some old rims cut a plate on my CNC plasma cutter welded that sucker in there and got it home um, this is like gnarly down in there I know you probably can't see down in there, but that thing's full of dirt and crap. This thing's been sitting out in the field forever and a day. I'm not going to show you all this stuff because a lot of you guys know more about it than me. Um, got some cancer down here. I'm going to cut new patch panels and put in there, though. Um, what is that? Clutch, brake. My brake looks like it's seen better days or something. Anyway, um, it's freaking cool, man. Oh, this is what I'm going to show you. I'm assuming that that is a um, fire extinguisher. I could be wrong. I don't know, but I'm thinking that that's probably what that is, is a fire extinguisher thing. But this, yes, it has an M16 machine gun rack in here that mounts in behind the door that my friend is freaking cool and there will be an ar-15 in its place so give you a quick check out of the dash um i don't know if any of the light i don't know if any of this works or not but i know the transmission works because i like to never get the sucker home because it uh it was locked into four-wheel drive low, and I had to unlock it. Snorkel, factory. Um, I've seen a bunch of these on the internet, but I haven't seen many that have the factory snorkel on it. Not blackout light. There's the, uh, it's the, Hose runs up to the canister for the uh, thing. It's got the original um, markings on it, which is sweet. I'm going to put tape over that when I paint it and then peel the tape off, so I'll leave that. Um, anyway, this is the old turbo tornado, whatever, tornado, not turbo. It's going to be turbo because I am pulling this motor out. <clears throat> Pulling this motor out, so anybody out there that needs a Tornado six-cylinder engine and transmission, hit me up, because uh, 
I'm going to be putting in a 6BT Cummins turbo diesel. And uh, I won't have a use for that anymore. So, anyway, it's bent right there. But I'll straighten all that out. I may even put a winch on it and, like, move that bumper out or something. I don't know. I'm going to do some jacking around with it. I want to keep it pretty well original, except for the power plant. I want a new power plant. This motor 